KOK World Series 2016 live on Fightbox. Ladies and gentlemen, now I would like to introduce title match of our event for the Bushido FC champion belt. We division 77 kilogram. Blue corner, fighter from Lithuania, Mindaugas Berzbitskas. So this is the main event, ladies and gentlemen. Here we are. We've made it to the fight number six. His opponent, ladies and gentlemen, Red Corner, fighter from Moldova, Vlad Popovsky. Two great fighting nations here. Lithuania is already in the ring. Mindikus versus Mikas from Lithuania in the blue. And facing the Lithuanian for this three rounds of five minutes for the MMA Bushido Rules title fight, Vlad Popovsky from Moldova. Here he comes. MMA Bushido Rules, mixed martial arts title fight. He makes the long walk, what is going through the fighter's mind. All the hard training, six to eight weeks training camp. Team hug, team spirit, all for the man. In the middle, the man from Moldova looks super concentrated. Vlad Popovsky from here in Kishno looking in absolute superb condition. Well, on paper again, this is fantastic matchmaking. Both fighters, very similar records. the national anthem of Lithuania. It's upstanding. Ladies and gentlemen, fighting for the red corner. 23 years old, official design, 178 centimeter, official weight, 77 kilograms. His professional record, 13 weeks, no losses. Champion of Republic of Moldova, and a many world champion, representing Ryan White Nigeria, Moldova.
remaining upstanding for the Moldovan national anthem. So the title fight at stake. Three rounds, five minutes. Unbroken record of Vlad Popovsky. 13 fights, 13 wins. Versus the gentleman facing with 14 fights, 11 wins, three losses on paper. Perfect again. Both fighters made the weight of 77 kilograms. The more stacked, solid Vlad Popovsky. Cut out of Moldovan concrete. This is the taller, leaner, Leiter Vindicus vs Bikas. Vindicus, the MMA gloves with the blue tape round, and in the red taped gloves, Vlad Popovsky straight into the middle of the meat. Underarms locked on. Scheduled if it goes. Three rounds of five minutes, 15 minutes of fighting for this title fight. MMA Bushido KOK belt up for grabs here. Two experienced guys, down he goes, catches the leg, first takedown. Goes from north to south, mount. Vlad in the top position. Mindikos underneath, goes into the side. Side control. What will happen if they go under the ropes? The referee will stop, reposition them, or stand them up. It goes into full guard. Top mount. And the ground and pound starts from the man from Moldova. Mindicus tries to wrap his legs round. Manages to roll over, but gets him in a... Oh, he had him in a leg triangle, but he's got out. Wow. Fast and furious stuff here at KOK in Moldova, live on Fightbox. We have a title fight tonight, and it's already started off pretty interesting. So, top position now. Mindikus, the man from Lithuania. But again, he manages to book him off and roll. Vlad takes top position. Inside the guard, stands up and goes for ground and pound. Tricky customer though, Mindikus. Takes a few headshots. And they're back to the feet. Stylish, these two. Using the Muay Thai clinch. Knees go in from both fighters. Body shots. Both fighters resorting to the Thai clinch. Solid uppercuts coming in from both guys. Both looking to shoot. Trying the leg lock, sorry, leg takedown. And the knee comes in, two knees, but the uppercut comes back in from Vlad. Going for the shoot, but he's got his arm. Oh, he's got out. And he's managed to take top position. Referee looking closely there in case the arm gets trapped in the ropes. And he's going for the triangle. But he's got his arm in there. Can he pull out? He manages it. Looks for his shots. Goes to ground and pound. Hammer strikes come in. Not too much power in those, but he's working them. Remains on top position inside the guard. 
So we've had four minutes. Tricky, stylish fighters, these two. Tries to buck him off. 40 seconds remaining. He's got out. Goes for the bike. Gets the heels in. Goes for the rear naked. Well, interesting stuff here. 20 seconds. Can he hold on? Very, very, very interesting, this. Goes again, tries again. He just can't get it on solid. And the bell's gonna go. Wow. Well, what an interesting first round. Five minutes of fantastic, fabulous fight action here at KOK, live on Fightbox. Mindicus versus Pickers. He is slippery as a snake. Vlad Popovsky, the undefeated gladiator. Solid as a rock, but it had to work. Fights really well from underneath Mindicus. One of the most dangerous positions to be in, but he absolutely knows how to counter and how to turn it around from off the back. Well, it went backwards and forwards that first round, and for me, I'm going to go a 10-10 round. That's how I see it. Don't know about you guys. Both had a share of that. So second round, three rounds of five minutes in this title fight, all to play for. Goes for the shoot, nullified. Throws the high kick, body kick goes in, he goes down. This time it is Mindicus takes top position. So will he stand them up or reposition? No, uh, sorry, stands them up. Right above me here now. Goes for the leg takedown and gets him, but manages to spin him over, takes top position. Vlad Poposki from Moldova. Mindikos versus Bikas underneath. Wants to go under the ropes, the referee will probably stop them. Goes for the ground and pound. Right here in the neutral corner, just to my left. His head's gone underneath. Now this time he's actually repositioned, so I don't understand why he didn't do that on the other side. Again, slippery stuff, but he's going for the arm, but he's, has he got it? Very slipperly, the Lithuanian, and look at that. Wow, goes for the ankle. Goes for the ankle lock, but manages to spin. It goes for the ground and pound. Right above me here. This is incredible stuff from these two athletes. Hammer fist come in. The man from Lithuania rains down. Very slippery customer on the ground for sure. Vlad holds on tight. But the man from Lithuania continues his onslaught. Both legs locked round the back. Inside the guard. Stands up. Again, fires down on Vlad. Just over halfway through round one, and it's Vlad underneath who's taking the referee calls action, otherwise you'll stand them up. 
So Mindikos versus Bickers again in top position. And the Moldovan crowd come alive to try and spur Vlad on because at the moment, Vlad is coming second at the moment. Well, he's seen enough. I don't know why, because he was busy, but he's standing them up. So this time, Vlad gets top position. One and a half minutes remaining. But like I said, Mindekos versus Bickers is one slippery customer on the ground, and he fights really well off his back. One of the best guys I've seen do this, look. Didn't quite make it that time, though. Ooh, goes for the ground and pound. But he has his shins in. Very tricky. Look at this, see what I mean? Very, very tricky. And the referee, I think, will either move him out, reposition. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, good referee in there. So again, it's Mindegus that's on top. Goes for the armbar. Using his foot as well. Vlad is trying to slide it out. Look at that. Wow. Going for the triangle again, but he's out. What a contest this is. This is what titles are made of. And it's not one of those that gets over in 30 seconds. Goes for the triangle. 10 second hammer's gone down. And I think he's not going to tap. He's, yeah, he's done it again. Wow. Incredible stuff. Well, for me, Blue Corner was the stronger in that one. I'm going to go 10 9 to Blue. Well, Vlad Popovsky looks the tighter of the two, slumps into his chair. Mindekas, first Bickers, stands up in the corner and looks still fresh. He might not be made look like he's cut out of stone or super ripped or stacked like his opponent, but you know what? Technique beats muscle. Wow. Here we see some of that action. Well, they only get one minute rest. We've had 10 minutes of fighting for me. The better fight at the moment. The better fight at the moment is coming from the way of Blue. I just feel that he has just got better technique and he's just been given, he's just had a good second round. Vlad looks a little bit tired, but anything can change. Right, the referee's not happy, I don't think, with the... Um, He's pulled the doctor in for something. Oh, sorry, I thought he said doctor. <laughs> no, water, sorry. <laughs> I thought he said doctor. Water, Wolf takes a shot. Final round, takes a knee and another knee. Torrid times for the Moldovan, taking some headshots with the knees. Mindicus is a man on a mission. The Lithuanian. Looks uncomfortable in the clinch. Taking some knees, down he goes. Well, it could all be over here. I think it might be. The referee's gonna step in. Yeah, it is. Look at that, the knees did the damage. It's all over, surely. Yeah, wow. I said he looked tired. Well, the man, if you put the two of them in the middle, you would have said, the guy, looking at that guy there, he was going to be anything in front of him, but he's all gone tonight. It's not what the local Moldovans wanted, but the man on a mission tonight, Vindicus versus Bickers. Wow, he's impressed me. Vlad Popovsky goes to 13 wins, 13 fights. Sorry, goes to 
14 fights, 13 wins, and his first loss is all has gone. And the man there, Mindekus first Bickers from Lithuania, goes to 15 fights, 12 wins, three losses. But he is now the Bushido MMA KOK champion. Wow. Incredible, ladies and gentlemen. There's the belt. European Bushido champion, and deservedly so. Sensational, emphatic win right at the start of round three. Commiserations to the man from Moldova, who took some real big knees. And then it was all downhill as he went to the floor. So the two main promoters, the inventor of KOK, Mr. Donato Simonatus, and a man from here, Moldova, the fabulous Damir Dorin, presenting the belts to the champion from Lithuania, Mindigus versus Bikus, who defeated Vlad Popovsky, unfortunately, from Moldova, didn't get the win. He certainly came to fight, he had his moments in the fight.